Hello, once again, this is Kareem Diaz speaking from Don Bosco Crystal Ray High School. And I am sitting here with Mr. Elias Blanco of Don Bosco Crystal Ray High School. And I will be talking to him about his first memories of the voting process and a little bit about this year's upcoming election. So, Mr. Blanco, yes. can you tell me about the first time you ever voted? Well, this is actually going to be my first time voting. Um, four years ago, I didn't have a chance because I wasn't a U.S. citizen. So I originally became a U.S. citizen about two years ago. Um, so I'm very excited that it's going to be my first time voting. I'm looking forward to it, and I did my research, so I'm ready to go to vote tomorrow. So. Uh, when you when you during that last election in 2004, did did you remember who you who you would like to vote for? Um, I don't particularly know that I had a, a candidate that I liked. Um, I just know that when I look for a candidate, I make sure that I, um, you know, focus on a candidate that, you know, has good moral values, um, you know, as far as like for the people and also on education. That's something that's very, I'm very passionate about. So both of those things together. Um, but I can't say that there was a candidate that I was really, I didn't do my research so much because I wasn't going to vote, so. Are there any, any of the, candidates that are running for president right now, do you think that exemplify those morals right now? Well, you can go either way because I think that both um, candidates have their strengths and weaknesses. Um, I'm not going to say particularly who I'm voting for, but I but I do look at those two things once again when I made a, when I've you know made up my mind about who I'm voting for this year. You know, both the moral issue and also uh, education. So those are two important issues. So. Well, there you have it. Straight from Mr. Blanco himself.